Hey y'all, it's Taryn. Welcome back to my channel and welcome to a bonus Friday video. So I have partnered with Dress Lily yet again for another video. This time we are doing fall outfits and Halloween costumes slash inspired things. The last video I did with Dress Lily when I tried a bunch of costumes, y'all really liked it. So I figured we should do it again. Now, yes, I am very aware that Halloween is tomorrow. However, I feel like 2020 is weird already. So if you wanna wear a costume the day after, you know what I'm saying? Like you do what you wanna do. Halloween, not everyone's trick-or-treating anyways. Maybe we just extend it for another week and you wear costumes every day. You can bring it up at your office meetings. You know, I feel like it's, it's you doing whatever it is that you wanna do for the year because 2020, I feel like, has been a little bit of a bust. Also think about next year's Halloween festivities because these costumes, most of these things are marked down in price. So you can go ahead and grab something for the next season. I also have a discount code. I will put it here on the screen. A big thank you to Dress Lily for partnering with me yet again on another video. I like Dress Lily. I find some really great things. They're not super expensive. Plus they have a great plus size selection of um, holiday, like you know, Christmas and Halloween and all those things. They have a great selection of unique things and that's what I like about it. So we are gonna try on quite a few things. I also have a couple of things for Brian. So I think that's fun too. So let's get into the try on. Oh, before we do that, everything you're about to see, I will link it in the description box down below. Be sure to check it out. I will also list the discount code below. Anything else that I wanna tell you? I don't think so. Let's get into it. This is the first outfit. I kind of thought, let's start with the Halloween things. That way if you see something you like, you can jump over to the website and grab it. And so when I picked this out, I thought it was a Halloween costume. I mean, it still could be, don't get me wrong, but the more I'm wearing it, I feel like this could be a really cute going out dress as well. So it's this beautiful green color. I'm wearing a size US 22 for reference. It has this really pretty lace bit here at the top, a little bit of ruching right there. These are actual strings that I have tied. So you can tighten them, untie them, whatever it is that you want to do with them, I think could be really cute. But what I think is really pretty about this is this underneath, now it's all one piece, yes. But this is like a ruched bodycon type piece at the bottom. How cute is this? And this sort of sits over it. Here's what it looks like from the back. Again, this is just sort of an overlay to the black skirt. Okay, I really like this. I feel like this is so comfy. Y'all know I'm not one to wear bodycon type things. So I almost feel very comfortable because I've got this bit of an overlay. This would be adorable with black, like pointed toe heels throw on like some big chunky jewelry and you've got an adorable date night going out type dress. All right, score for number one. Let's do this one next. So this one is definitely very Halloween in my opinion. It's a little bit Beetlejuice. Am I right? This one is also in a US size 22. Fits me absolutely perfect. I love this scene at the bottom. I think these kind of dresses are so cute and they're so fun, especially for someone who wants to be festive but doesn't really want to dress up in a costume. I think these are really fun and they serve the purpose of being festive but, you know, not being uncomfortable all day in a costume. So I love this top with this little bit here. I think that's really cute. I love the length of the sleeves. It does have a little bit of an elastic band here around the waist. It also zips up the side, but because it does have that extra elastic in it, I was able to just put it over my head, but it does have a zipper here in case you're wondering. This is a great length. This is so cute too. Why do I love this so much? Here's a look at it from the back. Okay, I might wear this one for real. I'm festive, but I'm not in a costume. Hey, hey. Okay, two for two. This one is adorable. I think, did I order another? I think I may have another dress like this. Let's see what else I have. So hear me out. This top is actually a lingerie set. So it's this green yellow color with these really pretty like velvety feeling bats and moons and stars. It comes with a pair of thongs, but 
I thought it would be cute to wear as a top. Like if you are a little bit more open and want to wear something a little bit more revealing, I guess. Um, so for the purpose of this, I paired it with these leggings. These also came from Dress Lily. They have skulls on the side with this like little ripped detail. They're probably capri length is what I would say. This set is in a size 3X, if I didn't say it came with a thong. And then these are in a size 4X. I will say these capri leggings are a little bit too big. So I would prefer them probably two sizes smaller. But if you wanted to throw on like a leather jacket and maybe, I don't know, some black skinny jeans, I feel like you could really get away with this as a tunic length tank top. I did put on a black bra with it just so that you could actually see my bra and that it didn't look like, you know, I had a nude bra on before. This is probably how I would style it if I was wearing it out for Halloween. So I just put on this like super fluffy cardigan, a pair of black joggers and a pair of little black heels. And yeah, this is how I would style this to wear out. Also these straps are adjustable on the baby doll style top, just for reference. Okay, I just pulled out the next outfit and it's a tutu. <gasps> oh my gosh, <gasps> I love this one. The only thing it has no stretch. Um, I ended up getting this one in a size 4X, which I think is equal to a US size 22. I'm pretty sure. I'm glad I got this size. I just left on the black bra because these straps are skinny. They are adjustable though. Oh my gosh. I love this. I just put these little black shoes on. You could put leggings underneath here if it was cold where you live or if you just wanted a little bit more coverage. I am in love with this. Everything about this, I don't have anywhere to go on Halloween. I mean, we technically have two things if I wanted to. So could I just wear this to one of them? Here's a look at the back. This is an elastic bit at the top. Again, the adjustable straps, like I mentioned. It also does zip up on the side, but I just pulled it over my head. So it is a little bit short for me. I'd probably wear leggings just to be safe. Oh my God. I love this. This is adorable, y'all. I kind of love this bit at the top. So this could be Halloween. Obviously, you could get away with so many different costume ideas with this look. But it's also a really cute fall dress, in my opinion. I love the red plaid. This lace is absolutely stunning. This does untie, obviously, to suck it down over your head. I also think the dress is very flattering. It also has a bit of lace at the bottom. This one's in a size 4X for reference. Here's what it looks like from the back. That lace bit does extend all the way around. It also has a bit of a like buffer padded bit on it so that that lace doesn't itch you too bad. I just tied this myself. This is adorable. This would be so pretty with like booties. I think you could also get away with heels, I think. Do we like this one too? Because I sure do. Let's do another red dress. I think this is the last red one I have. I do have another dress though. So what I like about this already are the thick straps. If you position them correctly, it can cover your bra, which I'm still wearing that black bra. I like this bit here. It's definitely Halloween with the bats the moon, the stars, that same velvety texture on these with the mesh bit, I think is really cute. I love these buttons. They're real buttons, but they don't have any function. But I think these are cute. It's a great length. I love the bit of black. It also has the bats and stuff on it down here. This is very comfortable. That black mesh extends around to the back, just plain red. I would say this one could be date night or going out as well, but it does have the bats on it. Um, but listen, I know people year round that wear things like this and they look adorable. So if it is cooler, you could throw on, let me put that cardigan back on. This is just the one that I have near me. So it's the one that you're seeing, but it just kind of cozies it up a little bit. This one may not be the right one for this dress, but I do think that these dresses are fun. And like I said, I know people in my personal life, like not on the internet, um, that really like wearing these types of dresses year round. So I think that you could definitely uh, get away with it. 
it's so pretty too and i think the little bit of detail here with the buttons and the mesh bit here is really pretty this outfit is so comfortable so i remember the last video i did i ordered a couple of the tops a little bit big and i had this really pretty tie-dyed one um, so I wanted to make sure that I ordered things the correct size. And I think I did, this one's in a size 4X. It's a white sort of racer back style tank with this lace bit. It's like attached to it. It's so pretty. I like this curved hem. Yeah, this is very cute. And these are actually leggings. I know they look like jeans, but they're leggings. That's fake. <laughs> Oh my gosh, these I do think I could have sized down maybe two sizes. This is a 4X. So they are leggings that look like jeans. And they make, let's see if I can make it right. They make a skull at the knees. I thought this would be cute together because it's very casual for someone who doesn't want to do too much for Halloween, but you still want to be, you know, part of the team. This I think is really cute. And yes, it's a tank top. Again, I won't throw on the same black cardigan you've seen 27 times already, but you could throw on a cute leather jacket, even a cardigan, something just to keep your arms a little bit warm because it is chilly outside. Here's a look at the tank top from the back. I love how long it is. And then these are the leggings. That's fake. I'm like uh, impressed with these. I like this one too. I could get away with wearing this all the time because I think this is just really pretty with some black skinnies, maybe a black leather jacket. I like this one. Okay, so I have one last thing to try on and then a couple things that I picked out for Brian. Last dress, as I mentioned. So this is a tad bit short on me. I am 5'8 for reference, but this definitely is meant to be a dress. I love these chambray shirt style dresses. I think they're so cute. I rolled one sleeve, buttoned the other one just so you could see the difference. These are snap buttons as well, which I really like. I was able to cinch this and tie it. These are functional pockets here. This is adorable. I would wear this with leggings though and maybe some booties. I really like this. It's in a size 4X. I think this was the perfect size. I like this one too. All right, the two things that I have for Brian, let me show you. I'll have to grab him when he gets home tonight. He has no idea that we're gonna do this tonight. He does know that I picked out some things for him because I made sure that he liked it ahead of time. Welcome back. It is several hours later, we have Brian. So as promised, I have two, well, more than two things, but things that I wanted Brian to try. So first thing we're gonna do is a set of socks. They came in one pack. It was like a Halloween festive um, kind of pack. And Brian, they can't really see him. Hold him up. Yeah. Brian tends to be, um, would you call yourself a funky sock funky connoisseur? Sock yeah. A connoisseur of funky socks? Yes. Um, so when I spotted these on the website, I thought that he would really love them because they're just fun. So um, we've got, how many pairs are there? Uh, what, five. Five pairs. Do you want to show them? All right. <clears throat> So we got a blue pair with pink roses and skulls, which is kind of, you know, cool. We've got the purple with jack-o'-lanterns. I feel like these could be in any time, like not just holidays oh, yeah. like or Halloween. Yeah. Okay. I'll be wearing these anytime. So, all right. These are like little dancing skeletons. Those are cool. Right here. I like these. We've got... These are more like maybe not even Halloween. They're just uh, champagne bottles with um, champagne glasses. Those would have been good for the wedding. Yeah, these would be cool. <gasps> Wouldn't they? Yeah. They would have been cool. And then these are little cauldrons, owls with bats. little purple witch hats and bats. So, all right. Which yeah. one of these is your favorite? Out of all these, probably the little dancing, I knew it. Uh, the little dancing skeletons. So you yeah. want to try those on? Sure. The feel of the sock, they're a really good quality sock. They're a dress sock, but not too thick, not too thin. Guys will know what I'm talking about, but it's a really good quality, and they feel really good. They're soft, um, and they look really oh, cool. Oh, cute. Yeah, they look nice. So, yeah. Look at them shoes. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, those look nice. I like them. So you'll wear all of them. So yeah, I'll wear these socks to work and I'll wear them when we go out and stuff like that. I really like funky socks. I very seldom wear a just plain old brown, black, blue sock. If I do, 
it would be an odd occasion <laughs> if I did. It, it just doesn't happen. Okay, we're going to move on to the next thing. Is this like blood spatter hoodie? It was from the men's section. And I, I don't know. I spotted it and thought it could be something fun. If you needed like an outfit for Halloween, but you didn't want to be like dressed up. Just like, just like sort of festive yeah. is what the, the word I've been using. All right, so he's going to put this one on. I ordered this, if you want to slide it on, okay. in a size extra large. Um, mm. For reference, Brian is, I don't know why I'm telling you his sizes, but he's typically like t-shirts in a size large. But if he's going to do, if I'm going to buy him a sweatshirt, I'll typically do like an extra large just because I feel like you would want more room. I like it. It's... It's real, it's more like a satiny finish or something. It's not like sweatshirt material, if that makes any sense. Um, I would say it probably runs a little small, seeing that this is an extra large. I would call this a large, all right? Which, so it fits me, fits me. Uh, so if you are, you know, whatever size you are, I would get the next size up. Mm -hmm. um, but I like the way it looks, I like the way it feels. Um, oh, it's got hand holes. Oh yeah, like oh, yeah, it's got handles hoodie. like a regular sweatshirt. And again, like I said, it does, you know, mirror kind of the back. Oops. It's super yeah. like cool looking. Have you ever had yeah. anything like that before? I have not. <laughs> I have not. Normally, my sweatshirts tend to just be like, I don't know. I'm yeah. an Auburn Ooh. University fan, so I like you know logo Auburn stuff or lo college logo or sport team logo, but. Uh, I like it. It's uh, it's cool. That's it. Yeah, it's real smooth. Yeah, real real soft and smooth. So yeah, I, like I feel it. like looking at it, you could almost like if it's not Halloween, it could look like paint spatter. Like you could almost get away with it if you want to like be a cool dressing like yeah modern yeah, type. Yes, uh, it could sort of be paint spatter. Sort yeah, of. It could be paint spatter. It could yeah. be blood spatter. Whatever you want it to be for your particular occasion. Yeah. All right. You have seen everything on me. You've now seen the things that Brian, I was going to say Brian picked out, but really I picked them out. Oh, yeah. I didn't have anything. How did I do? Did, did good, especially on the socks. Yeah. I'm a sock guy. So, yeah. yeah. Everything you just saw me try on and Brian try on, I will link in the description box down below. Um, don't forget the discount code. It is linked there as well. Again, thank you to Dress Lily for sending these things and partnering with me for this video. And thank you for watching. If you enjoyed it, what do they need to do? They need to subscribe <laughs> to her channel. <laughs> Thanks, y'all. We'll see y'all in my next video. Bye.